how does a brother go from Harvard Law to theater? Because I personally, the best actor I've ever seen was Johnny Cochran. If it doesn't fit you, he was a rapper. Yes. <laughs> so in that sense, I, I can see the transition. But how did you make that transition? Right. Well, I think you hit something really, really powerful there. I think law is definitely theater, right? Uh, especially for litigators who get up and have to to perform the most persuasive argument, the most most persuasive storyteller, right? In that sense, it's the griot or the jolly tradition that the best black lawyers are still carrying on. Thurgood Marshall to Johnny Cochran to Charles Ogletree, all these folks who just are amazing in the courtroom, they have that presence, that charisma, and that intellect that I think is part of our tradition going back to ancient times. Um, my father, you know, was seeing clips of music when I was a kid, so I was, I was performing Harry Belafonte's music at seven years old, um, having no idea that, you know, 20 something years later, you know, he, he and his daughter Gina Belafonte would be our, our executive producer for this show here. Uh, but in law school, I performed throughout college, throughout, I took dramatic writing in college, I went to NYU for grad school and, and, and took as much performance as I could while I was at NYU. And then in law school, one, one of my professors brought in a theater troupe that was doing theater in prisons in upstate New York. And they worked with the class, all the law students, and I was like, that's what I'm supposed to do, you know. So uh, I when I graduated from law school with all of the sort of media hype that I had around my, my case and you know, 60 Minutes when I was in my second year in law school. I organized artists and activists to go into prisons in about 25 states around the country. And one of the things we did was theater. So we did theater, uh, theater of the press, very influenced by Augusto Boa from Brazil, and a lot of interactive theater to deal with the problems and solutions that uh, existed and needed to exist in the prison that we're in about. Please come and see Lyric from Lockdown. Lyrics from Lockdown, the National Black Theater. Uh, it's Saturdays and Sundays, Saturdays at 2 and 8 and Sundays at 4. And it's running until? February 24th. It's one more week. Yeah, you can get tickets at nationalblacktheater.org and you don't want to miss the show, so uh, get your tickets quick. So I want to thank you again for taking out the time. Thank you. This is uh, great to meet you after seeing your work and I'm grateful. Thanks, you. We really appreciate the opportunity to be here.